Welcome back to the series of life part. Um, yeah, what we what we were saying about Walter Bishop and that and that series. And he, you know, people need to to if you watch the series, then you'll understand exactly what I'm saying about dimensions and how much dimensions and how much earth dimensions. Because okay, it's like the Bermuda Triangle. People think yeah, the Bermuda Triangle and so for so much things is this as disappear, you know, and the ocean. Uh, um, there's a plane that disappeared the other day, and no one knows. And there's a lot of prediction and then a lot of stuff. And okay, I will not go in. <laughs> I'm not going too far in that, but. There are different di okay, you should look at now the past, the present, and the future in one. Some people are just not ready to do that. Some people just don't have the capacity, the capability of um stepping out of the box and um looking out of the box and realizing that there's more to life, uh, you know. Some people think, woo, this cuckoo uh -huh. no honey I'm not cuckoo you're the one who's cuckoo because you sit in the box when you open your own sense of understanding and understand that there is so much that we weren't taught in school and so much that we haven't learned when you really um, call up your I self and your mighty I am present and said listen it is time. I need to know. Is this woman speaking rubbish? Or is she really? She has something. She have a point. She she's given um what good information or what is it? When you're ready and you're open and you're really ready. Sorry, I'm looking up my hair. You're really ready to um accept and understand um who you are and you want to know exactly. Who you are and your eye self will reveal that to you your subconscious your unconscious will reveal that to you and I there is a lot of information there's a lot of stuff and this is what I always tell people what resonates with myself maybe don't resonate with you or somebody else or maybe 50 persons but every one of us is like and that's why I said we are angelical beings living in a human body and the, the most funny funny thing is that when I was on my journey and I started and I I, I, I always know that I was different I I was different I just couldn't take violence I couldn't take people who lie I couldn't take I would prefer to to, to, to close off myself from from people who resonate that doesn't resonate in my thing that I, I just can't take people who dishonestly um go out to hurt somebody else you know because we are all one and when we understand that we are all one then you know life will be much better on this planet i think you know and the part that i really want to get to you is that you need to find out what is your life part when you find out what is your life part then you will understand all the karmic energy that you have gone through all the stuff all the challenges all the upset in your life all, all the stuff that happened why you had gone through that because i i i i you know um the 33 energy 33 6 energy because I carry 33 6 energy that's what I'm working on in this lifetime on hurt and I've been to earth um, more times before but I could never um, deal with a vibration here because people are so I come from a planet or should I say a planet um, all right source creator okay um, you have angels, you have different types of angels, you have different um, uh, frequencies. And what happened is that when we enter in the, the earth frequency, we tend to forget all the information that we came in. in. We, we, we meet the people and we work our karmas out, but we tend to 
forget the information just like we forget the information who are we uh, who we are and what vibrations are we going to work on and um, what are we going to work out with other people and it's so strange because we we tend to forget that we tend to forget that and all of us tend to forget that until um, you realize that people become spiritual after the age of 50 or after the age of 40 40 they start to change around you know and when um people who work with mental patients i mean is any re anyone really a mental patient everyone came here to do a specific jobs it's just like the people who are killers, murder, rapists, or so. They came here to work out karma with other people. And when we look at that and we can understand it, that we can realize that, you know, then we understand why we are all here. So they came to work out karmas with people. And hurt is just a school when you learn that earth is just a school so everything you make your own movie when you're on earth it's like you're you're, you're writing your own scripts you're playing out your own scenes you're you're heading it headed in it and uh, you know you are making your own movies just like I make these videos because no one helped me to make them I make them and I'll pass everything on I am making these videos because I know that there are people out there who need these help. This was what I was sent here to do. I was sent here to help people understand that there is more between heaven and her. That is what we say in the earth thing. I want to wake up people to their true potential and to let them understand that, you know, life is full of surprises. There's trauma, there's challenges, there are challenging people in your life. And I have worked on the most difficult energies in my entire life. But I am sitting here and I want to help other people because I um I have this gift, I have this urge, and that is it. When you begin your ascension, when you begin to ascend, you have this urge to help people and you you need to open up and um, open up to a wider range of people and this is my way of of, 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 of helping people is by doing these videos well, going back to what I was saying these videos I do myself I edit them myself and it takes time but you know um, this is what I'm supposed to do and this is how I can help people there are a lot of people out there, things are happening to them and they're so uh, afraid because they don't want to go to the doctors because then they're going to be placed in, in as um, um, people who are mentally ill or, or, or people who are strange or whatsoever. I don't think we should label people because we are all beings here on this planet trying to make a life, trying to play our part, trying to make our movie, trying to learn the lessons that we came here to learn. And trust me, people who carry double number, it's like 11, 22, life part, energy, 33, especially 33, 6. It is the hardest life part number to carry. And I'm telling you, I have had traumas, all so you know just everything I think the last one that really got me was my mother and that's why I choose to do to to choose my life part and she died and she she really fought she 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 fought for two years breast cancer and you know I remember she she called me and she she yeah she gave up and you know I got there in time, God rest her soul, and she is the one who, because after she died, I am saying, I, I was saying, Mom, why you left me at this, in this planet, and um, it was, it was hard, it takes me two years, 
it was really two years I said just but that's not the point the point is that there is more between heaven and earth your life point and life number life part number pushes you to really find out your true potential who you are then you understand what is it why these things why these challenges situations sometimes it's not your karma I can tell you this people sometimes it's not your karma sometimes people just ask you um, to work with them to work out their karma because um, people um, who use the 33 6 energy who works on it because that's what was placed in our DNA so uh, from from ever since you were small you did all these things happening and we were sent here to help other people clear their karma most of the time we don't have karma with these people but we um, have had so many so many lives and we are we vibrate at a total higher level than these people and that's why people who are 33 6 they can see things they can see the past present and the future just in one and other people don't understand that they are um, they're really empathic and they are the healers and the leaders um, and that's why we have to work as light workers and under the flag as life workers because um, our energy feel is to heal people so wherever we go it's like sometimes 33 people they attract a lot of people and wherever they go they when they speak they speak but they speak on a soul level they see people from a soul level and not from the outer um, what someone it look look like um, they see people from a soul level they connect with people from the art level the soul level and if they don't connect with you um, they know from before that there is something that doesn't resonate your energy vibration doesn't um, uh, vibrate with their energy so what they will do is send you love but they will stay away from you let's say it that way and they always tend to get challenges situation and challenged people because people see their light and people want to take their light away you know like everyone um, vibrates um, with a different frequency and 33 six people vibrate with a very high frequency because they help to to not only hold the energy on hurt and cleanse the energy on hurt but they um, heal people just by talking to them by walking around or being the energies and this is why sometimes um, people um, were born in one country and then they live in another country and then they go live in another country and then they end up in another country when they're older it's because they need to go to these places to clean the energies and people think oh well the travel is so fine you live in so many cup no 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 the <laughs> the point is that um you hold the energy to go someplace to clean you know it's like different there is so many different beings that we are we are just angelical we're just beings living in a human body having a human experience and it it is so powerful is it's, it's so people do not understand it because people don't even want to step out of the box people on hurt only think about materialistic thing it's like they come to hurt to work out their karma to to learn their lessons and they get stuck here there are so many souls who get stuck here and I am like you know the sooner it is for me to leave here is the better for me <laughs> and people are thinking you know and that's why I don't understand when people um, are afraid to die you never die you know people never die your soul just live on you know and 
you leave earth and you go home and you rest wherever that is um and you 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 go on you get new um it's like projects to do and then you go to somewhere else you know or you come back to her because you haven't finished because they're gonna send you here back you know and this time I I need to stress this more and more because I don't have enough time to do this video on the life part number but this time on earth we need to use this time to clear all the karmas we need to pass the exam before 2032 and that is why we need to um, remember honesty love sincerity clean your heart chakra open your heart open up yourself to understand and the intellectual awaken your right brain hemisphere and your left brain hemisphere merge them together call up your higher self and ask your higher self to merge with you and take over ask source creator for the divine um, message that he has for you ask your guides and angel to awaken your divine blueprint to you we will help you to know what is your life part number and with that you will know what direction and which way you need to go I am open that this video will awaken and trigger something in you so that you go and please go and find out the information we're always here you can mail us and we need you know as usual the information just mail us you need your life part number with your life part number you get a totally profile of who you are truly ask your angels and guides everybody has an angel everybody has a guide some people have more or more guides and I'm asking more light workers um, more beam as myself to come out because I know there's a lot there's a lot of there's a lot of us here and the location that I'm in now um, there's a lot there's there are more of us who choose not to do it but if you choose to do it or you choose not to do it it is your choice but um, ask for help from the rest of the universe from your solar system from all the thing because we need help on um, this planet at this time because it's um, if we don't open up ourselves to understand that there is more beneath the eyes and um, this planet need to rebirth help mother her through this process then we <laughs> we're just as light workers trying to help everyone to understand open your heart open your mind there is more find your true potential understand what this whole movie you're playing is all about and accept who you are work on it to better yourself we're not here to try and make people do things we're um, actually giving you information and we're saying also research it research it find out things for yourself but try and first you work on yourself the things that you weren't taught in school about yourself the things that has never been told to us by our parents because our parents didn't know it and our parents 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 before that didn't know it but break yourself from the illusion and open yourself to understand that there is more between heaven and earth and this is where I'm leaving you and I want to say and I'm sending love light and peace to all the persons all of us who have came down to use the um, 33 6 energy I know it has been a rough ride it has been an absolutely enormous ride with this energy that we're using that we came down with or 33 6 
don't give up. Don't give up. Because if we give up at this moment, we can't help to move the planet further. Please don't give up. Um, we're here, we were sent here to do a job and we need to do it. It's hard and I know it's hard, but every time that challenges situation comes up, you have to say, I'm calm and still, I love myself and I always will. I am calm and still, I love myself and I always will. I'm sending you love and light, peace. Bring back love to hurt. That's what we're here for.